guys welcome back to my channel today I'm going to do an empties video um, I didn't want to accumulate too much stuff because I know that these are best when they're short and sweet so I just wanted to go through a couple of things that I've used up over the past month or so um, so let's get started I have them in my <laughs> J. Crew bag um, the first thing is this St. Ives Blackhead Clearing Green Tea Scrub. So this claims to clear blackheads and calm redness, oil-free, salicylic acne medication, sulfate-free, sulfate paraben-free, 100% um, natural exfoliants. I didn't use all of this up. Um, I didn't notice that it was clearing like the clogged pores on my nose or anything like that. So um, I did get this at the drugstore think like my local grocery store um, so I wasn't really that impressed so I used about to there and I was just kind of over it so I probably won't repurchase that um, the next thing is my Redken sulfate free blonde idol um, shampoo so this is a gentle pH balanced care for your hair looks like this I do love this it makes my hair super soft um, I really really enjoyed this but I always switch up my shampoos and conditioners so I'm using something else right now um, but I really did enjoy this let's see if it has anything um, softens blonde hair with lightweight moisture um, violet leaf extract and lactic acid to help strengthen and boost shine so blonde hair looks bright soft and beautiful yeah, so I would agree with all of those things. I really, really enjoyed this Redken shampoo. Um, and I didn't have the conditioner because I use a different kind of, I was using, I was using a different kind of conditioner. Um, so I'll have to get that next and try it out. But I really did like that. Next is the Aveeno Positively Radiant Skin Brightening Daily Scrub with Moisture Rich Soy Extract and Gentle Microbeads. So it looks like this. I didn't use all of this up. I have just like a tiny bit left. I wouldn't say this works as well as some of the other brightening scrubs that I have, but I did like it. It was all right. See, it has natural soy extract with smooth round microbeads to gently exfoliate while you cleanse. So I guess I like my exfoliator um, because I do use my Retin-A. I like my exfoliator like a finely milled sugar or a finely milled bead um, with lots of beads in there. So it really takes off that dead skin. Um, and this just didn't, it wasn't as grainy as I like it. But it was okay. So if you like a gentle exfoliator, you could try this out. Next is my or was my Chanel Ultra Correction Line Repair um, SPF 15 Anti-Wrinkle Sunscreen Day Fluid. So this is my daily moisturizer. Um, I wouldn't repurchase this. I didn't notice, I mean I don't have terrible wrinkles, but I do have fine lines. So I didn't notice that it really plumped my skin. Um, it is a cream, a lightweight cream moisturizer it does give your skin a nice overall healthy radiance mm, and I love the way Chanel moisturizers smell it smells so good and clean yeah I'm just I wasn't terribly impressed and I like my origins that I'm using now better so I probably won't repurchase that actually I know I won't okay and this is like random but I wanted to throw this in there because I really love this toothpaste it's the 3d white Lux um, glamorous white removes removes up to 90% of surface stains in five days I don't know about all that but it does keep my teeth nice and white I do use um, zoom whitening so if you want a review on my at home zoom whitener kit then um, just leave a comment below and I'll be sure to do that but this is just like really minty fresh it just leaves my my teeth so so clean feeling um, and I really like it and I like in other people's videos the other empties that I watch I like to see like their everyday products even if it's toothpaste or whatnot because I think that it you know if something's working for you then why not share it so I like that I did this is kind of dirty but I did use up a um, Clarisonic deep pore cleanser this is my favorite brush head for my Clarisonic I have um, let's see for Christmas I got the cashmere brush head and I don't like it um, so I ordered another one of these and this was probably my most my probably my favorite product out of my empties that I used this past month 
It is the Probiotic Skin Care by Pierre F. It's the Energizing Facial Scrub, Vitamin B, and a Kai Berry. It stimulates microcirculation, superfruit revitalizes skin. Let me just tell you how freaking amazing this product is. I have the little sample size here because um, at the supply house where I get all of my um, hair color and stuff like that, they have these sitting up front. They don't have the, um, it's newer line, so they don't have the full bottles yet. But this, literally, I used it the first time, and it brightened my face. I mean, I can't even explain to you how amazing this scrub is. It's that finely milled, really, really gritty, textured ex um, exfoliator, and you just rub it along your skin, and my all the dead skin was taken off. I even used it on my lips. My lips were so moisturized. I cannot rave about this product enough. Um, anyway, so it's by the Pierre F brand. And I did look it up online, so I'll leave the link below. Um, anyway, I won't go into it too deeply to keep this video short. But I seriously, seriously love all of the Pierre F products. Okay, and then next is this Caldrea Essential Collection Ginger Honey Exfoliating Scrub um, with natural essential oils, ginger, and nutmeg. Looks like this. I barely used any of this. I'm probably going to give it to my sister or something. I just, it didn't do anything great for my skin. I like my Seabooth um, Exfoliator and that, um, that new one that I blocked about. Deep Steep, I think is the name. But I like those better, and this just really didn't do it for me. So I'll set that over there to give away. Um, I did want to share my favorite individual lashes. I've tried, I've tried so many brands, and I like the Ardell Professional Individual Multi Pack, and it has like the short, medium, long in there, and it look, it comes in the the big package like this. Um, you get 112 flares, and I get these at the supply house, and I just love these. I really, really love those. I use them on, like, all my brides and everything. Okay, so here's another PRF that I used up. It's the Probiotic Skin Care Moisturizing Cleanser, Vitamin E, and Noni. Noni or Noni? I don't know how to say it. Enhances moisture retention. Superfruits help slow aging. It is just, again, a great cleanser. Absolutely love it. Um... By the Pierre F brand. Okay, and then I have a few Mac lingering eyebrow pencils. I go through the, <laughs> I go through these things like, I mean, like crazy. I absolutely love them. The lingering is just perfect. That's what I have on today. And I have a Chanel Le Volume mascara in the black color. I think they only, I'd be like, yeah, and it's just black. Um, I have talked about this quite a few times, so I won't go into crazy detail about it, but it is just absolutely phenomenal. My favorite, favorite mascara. Okay, and then the last thing I have that I've used up that I will back to MAC is my Studio um, Fix MAC Powder. <sighs> Got a little brush here and there. <laughs> um, I go through these probably once every... I guess maybe three months, three or four months. Um, I use it every day. I love it. It gives just a little bit extra coverage. I use it to bronze with. Um, yeah, and it's just a great, great powder. If you wanted to use this alone, let's see, my color is NC45. If you wanted to use this alone as like a powder foundation, you could totally do that. It would be um, just great, lightweight um, coverage, but still just cover up a little, any imperfections that you have. So yeah, that's all I have for this empties video. I hope you guys enjoyed it and found something um, that you might want to try out. Leave a comment below and let me know what you want to see next. I will be doing a hair care video for those of you that have asked um, really soon. I hope you guys enjoyed and I will talk to you really soon. Bye!